What if I told you there's an AI system that can literally reanimate the dead? Not like zombie apocalypse stuff, but using AI wizardry to breathe new life into old photos and voices from long ago. Sounds like crazy talk, right? Well, hold on to your seats, because the tech I'm about to break down for you today is exactly that insane. Okay, let me set the scene. Imagine you've got this old photo of your grandpa from back in the day. Just a still image, but you've also got a recording of him telling some wild stories in his classic raspy voice. Wouldn't it be wild if you could somehow combine the two and make your grandpa's picture come alive? Having his face animated to match the audio, with his mouth moving naturally and his head bobbing along with his ex expressions, like a moving, talking portrait video? Well, thanks to some incredible new AI research from the geniuses over at Tencent, that insane sci-fi dream is now a reality with this tech called Annie Portrait. These mad lads have engineered a mind-blowing system that can literally animate a still photo just from an audio clip as input. Just take any sound file of someone talking or singing, plus a reference photo of their face, and boom, Annie Portrait spits out a seamless video of that person's face animated to sync up perfectly with the audio. Lips moving, expressions changing, head turning side to side the whole nine yards. It's absolutely bonkers. So how does this voodoo magic actually work under the hood? Well, buckle up, folks, because this gets pretty wild. Essentially, Annie Portrait uses two main stages of heavy-duty AI modeling. In the first stage, it extracts all these intricate 3D representations of the face shape, lip movements, head position, and more just by deeply analyzing the raw audio file. It's like the system can imagine what someone's face would look like making those specific sounds. But the real sorcery happens in the second stage, where Anna Portrait throws those 3D face representations into a highly advanced diffusion model along with the reference photo. This diffusion model is like a super AI artist that paints an insanely photorealistic animated portrait video frame by frame, using the reference pick to lock in the person's identity while precisely matching all the subtle lip sync and head motion to the original audio. It's like a, a wildly powerful deepfake video creator, but specialized just for making faces come alive from audio. Honestly, the results I've seen are downright terrifying in their realism. You'd swear these animated portraits were just recordings of an actual person and not some AI trickery. Every single lip movement, uh, every squint of the eyes, every little facial tick is rendered in exquisite detail, perfectly lip synced to the original speech or, or singing track. It's almost disturbingly lifelike. But here's maybe the coolest part. Because Annie Portrait separates the face animation pipeline into distinct stages with a 3D face mesh representation in the middle, that means you can edit and manually tweak those 3D facial features in all kinds of wild ways before feeding them into the final video rendering. With some clever editing, you could make the same source animation look angrier, sadder, or goofier. Or you could take the facial landmarks from one source and stitch them onto a totally different ID photo to create wild deepfake style effects. It's a creative meme maker's dream come true. Enough talking about it. Let's actually see this insanity in action. For all you coding connoisseurs out there, the mad lads at Tencent have graciously open sourced the Annie Portrait system so we can try running it ourselves. I'll include a Google Colab link down in the description to get you started. The process is honestly pretty straightforward once you've got the code fired up. First thing is to connect to a GPU runtime because, as you can imagine, this level of photorealistic video generation is crazy computationally intensive. From there, under the config slash inference folder, you'll find a spot to upload your own reference image to animate, as well as dropping your audio file into the audio folder. Before hitting that final cell, though, you'll need to edit the config slash prompts animation audio.yaml file to point any portrait at your specific image and audio files for the test case. Just plug in those file paths and you're good to go. Now hit run on that final cell and sit back while the AI black magic gets cooking. Fair warning though, this process is painfully slow, even on a decent GPU setup. I'm talking rendering times of like 40 minutes just for a 30 second clip. That diffusion model pulling all those photoreal frames out of a bottomless toilet is just an insane amount of calculation. But when it finally does complete, you'll be rewarded with your very own self-animated Annie portrait creation in all its glory. Definitely a thrill to see your random reference image suddenly bursting into expressive life, mouth moving in sync to the audio better than any human animator could manage. It's like the uncanny valley, but in a mind-blowingly awesome way this time.
So that's my quick start guide to getting Annie Portrait up and running for all my nerdy coders and AI tinkers out there. 怎么说三两句话？就是开始说脏话了呢。Of course, I'm just scratching the surface. There's a whole world of crazy audio editing and pose manipulation tricks you can dig into once you've got the basics down. Now, of course, being early research from an AI lab, Annie Portrait isn't a perfect consumer-ready product yet. There's bound to be some funky artifacts and limitations compared to painstakingly hand animating everything. But holy crap! Just the fact that this kind of Seamless audio to video technology exists at all is mind melting. Just imagine the crazy potential applications once this tech gets refined and rolled out on a bigger scale, animating old photos and audio logs to bring historical figures to life in the classroom, creating hyper realistic animated audiobook readings with a 3D talking head model of the author, or heck, my classic dream of somehow de-aging and animating those amazing old recordings of my late grandparents so I can have memorable new videos of them again. I mean, that alone would be absolutely priceless to me. So there you have it, squad. The world's first glimpse at AI systems that can literally make still photos come alive with just a speech track. Whether you think that's amazing or terrifying, you've got to admit it's a huge leap forward for facial animation technology. But I want to hear your crazy takes. What mind-bending applications or use cases for Annie Portrait can you dream up? Maybe some Black Mirror horror story ideas about how this could go horribly wrong, or just general geeking out over how insanely impressive the AI trickery is here. Drop all your wildest thoughts down in the comments, and let's get this discussion popping. And of course, smash that like button if you want to see more wild AI breakdowns from yours truly. There's so much mind-bending stuff on the horizon. We're just getting started. I'll catch you, legends, on the next one.